Zendesk is great for customer service, but what happens when a customer needs an RMA to return a defective product? Support Sync for Zendesk lets your customer service agents create, view, and edit product returns without ever leaving the Zendesk platform. In this video, we'll create a Support Sync account and install the Zendesk app. Next, we'll see how easy it is to create a product return right from Zendesk. Then, we'll explore how to receive, process, and ship returns in the native Support Sync application. Let's get started. If you don't already have a Support Sync account, go to www.supportsync.com and click the free trial button. Fill out the form with your company info. Choose your unique Support Sync domain, which is normally your company name followed by supportsync.com. Be sure to remember your domain and login credentials as you'll need them to install and log in to the Zendesk app. Click Submit to create your Support Sync account. Now let's install the Zendesk app. In Zendesk, click the gear icon and choose Marketplace under Apps. Search for Support Sync and click the logo. Now click the Install button and choose the Zendesk account to install the app. Click Install. On the App Installation page, enter your unique Support Sync domain in the SS Domain field and click Install. The Support Sync app is now installed. Let's open a ticket to load the app. Now we'll log in using our Support Sync username and password. Let's see how easy it is to create a return for a customer in Zendesk. First, we'll create a new user and ticket. The full name and email of the end user is required. Click the Create Return button to get started. First, we'll enter the customer's shipping address and phone number. Notice that the Autocomplete feature offers suggestions when you start typing an address. Also, address verification is provided by USPS to help prevent delays. Click Next to continue. Now we'll select a return reason and choose the product. You can customize return reasons and add more products in the native Support Sync app. Multiple products and quantities can be added to a return. The action field is used to specify if the product should be repaired or replaced. This value can be changed later during the process. Click Next to continue. Now we can choose from several return types. We'll choose standard return, which means we'll be shipping out a replacement product and receiving the original back from the customer. If a payment is required, you can specify the amount and currency here. The ship by option lists custom shipping methods that correspond to major carriers. Check the Advanced Replacement option if you want to send the replacement product before the defective product is received. The Prepaid Label option lets you cover the cost of return shipping by sending a postage paid shipping label to the customer. Enter any required comments in the Notes field. Notice that the Zendesk ticket number is entered by default. Click Next to continue. On the summary screen, we can review the information for the return and make changes if required. To create the return, click the Submit button. The return has been created. Now let's go back to the ticket. 
Notice we can see the customer's shipping information and a list of their returns whenever we open the user or one of their tickets. This way, your customer service agents can always see the latest status of the return right in Zendesk. While the Zendesk app allows customer service reps to create and track RMAs, the actual processing is done in SupportSync. Let's open SupportSync to explore how a typical return is received, processed, and shipped by your warehouse team. First, since this is an advanced replacement, we'll ship a replacement product out to the customer. The integrated shipping feature makes it easy to create and print shipping labels. Back in the Zendesk app, notice that the status has been updated and the tracking information for the outgoing package is available. Next, we'll send a prepaid label to the customer via email. Prepaid labels can also be printed individually or in batch mode. When the package arrives, we'll receive it into the system which will close out the return. Back in the Zendesk app, the latest updates are instantly available to your customer service agents. With the Support Sync app for Zendesk, your entire support team will always be in sync so you can provide the best service possible to your customers. See our other videos on our website under Support for more information about configuring and using Support Sync to manage your product returns. This concludes installing and using the Support Sync app for Zendesk. Please send any questions to help at supportsync.com. And thanks for watching.